Welcome to Easy Driver, the most reliable source of automotive information on YouTube. Thank you for visiting us, and many thanks to those who have subscribed, liked, commented, and shared our videos. Welcome to our guide on how to troubleshoot a windshield washer pump. If you've ever found yourself in a situation where your windshield washer system is failing to function properly, you're in the right place. Your safety on the road depends on clear visibility, making it crucial to address any issues with your washer pump promptly. When your windshield washer pump malfunctions, it can be frustrating and even hazardous, especially during inclement weather conditions. In this post, we will walk you through the common signs of a faulty washer pump, the potential causes behind the problem, and step-by-step -step troubleshooting techniques to help you diagnose and resolve the issue efficiently. Whether you're dealing with a weak spray, no spray at all, strange noises coming from the washer pump or other related issues, understanding how to troubleshoot your windshield washer pump can save you time and money. By following the practical tips and solutions outlined in this guide, you'll be equipped to tackle the problem head-on and get your windshield washer system back in optimal working condition. Stay tuned as we dive into the essential steps to troubleshoot your windshield washer pump effectively, ensuring a clear and unobstructed view while driving. Let's get started on resolving this common automotive issue and keeping your windshield clean and clear for safer travels ahead. Understanding the windshield washer pump. Windshield washer pumps are essential components of a vehicle's washer system, responsible for spraying cleaning fluid onto the windshield to ensure visibility while driving. Function of the windshield washer pump. The windshield washer pump operates by drawing washer fluid from the reservoir and pumping it through the washer jets onto the windshield. When you activate the washer system using the control stock or button inside the car, an electric pump generates pressure to propel the cleaning solution onto the windshield, effectively removing dirt, bugs, and other debris that obstruct your view. Common symptoms of a faulty windshield washer pump. No washer fluid spraying. One of the most obvious signs of a failing washer pump is when pressing the button or lever does not result in any fluid being sprayed onto the windshield. Weak spray. If the fluid sprays onto the windshield ineffectively or with reduced pressure, it could indicate a problem with the pump or clogged nozzles. Unusual noise. A humming or whirring noise coming from the washer pump when activated might suggest a mechanical issue that requires attention. Leaking washer fluid. Puddles of washer fluid under the vehicle or around the pump area could indicate a leak, signaling a need for inspection and potential replacement. 5. Intermittent functionality. Inconsistent operation, where the washer pump works sporadically or only under certain conditions, can point to underlying electrical or mechanical issues. By understanding the function and recognizing the symptoms of a faulty windshield washer pump, you can take timely action to maintain the effectiveness of your vehicle's washer system and ensure clear visibility on the road. Initial assessment and preparation. Before diving into troubleshooting your windshield washer pump, it's essential to conduct an initial assessment and prepare yourself for the task at hand. Gather necessary tools and materials. To begin, make sure you have all the tools and materials required for the job. You'll need basic items such as a screwdriver, pliers, rags, a bucket for draining fluids, and a new washer pump if replacement is necessary. Having everything on hand will streamline the troubleshooting process and prevent unnecessary delays. Locate the windshield washer pump. The next step is to locate the windshield washer pump in your vehicle. Typically, the pump is situated near the washer fluid reservoir. Consult your car's manual if you're having trouble finding it. Identifying the pump's exact location will allow you to access it easily and assess any potential issues effectively. By following these steps and ensuring you're well equipped and informed, you'll be ready to tackle the troubleshooting process for your windshield washer pump. Stay tuned for the next section where we delve into diagnosing common windshield washer pump problems. Troubleshooting Steps When troubleshooting issues with your windshield washer pump, following a systematic approach can help identify and address the problem effectively. Below are the key steps to troubleshoot a windshield washer pump. Step 1. Checking Fuse and Power Supply Begin by checking the fuse related to the windshield washer pump in the fuse box. A blown fuse can often be the culprit behind a malfunctioning pump. If the fuse is intact, proceed to inspect the power supply to the pump. 
Use a multimeter to ensure that power is reaching the pump when the washer button is activated. Step 2. Inspecting washer fluid level and lines. Next, verify the washer fluid level in the reservoir. If the fluid is low, the pump may not be able to function correctly. Additionally, examine the washer fluid lines for any kinks, leaks, or blockages that may be impeding the flow of fluid to the pump. Clear any obstructions and ensure that the lines are free from damage. Step 3. Testing the pump directly. If the fuse, power supply, fluid level, and lines are all in order, the next step is to test the pump directly. Disconnect the pump from the washer system and supply it with power independently to see if it is working. If the pump fails to operate when powered directly, it may need to be replaced. However, if the pump functions outside of the system, the issue may lie elsewhere in the circuit or wiring. By methodically following these troubleshooting steps, you can pinpoint the underlying cause of windshield washer pump issues and take appropriate measures to resolve them effectively. Remember to always prioritize safety and consult a professional if needed. As we conclude the first part of our two-part series on troubleshooting your windshield washer pump, we hope you've gained valuable insights and practical tips for addressing common issues. Stay tuned for part two, where we'll delve deeper into advanced troubleshooting techniques and potential repairs. Until then, may you continue to maintain your windshield washer pump and enjoy clear visibility on the road. Please comment, like, share, and subscribe for more automotive information like this. Thank you for watching.